trick tip. I've made some lives about um, how to remind some song, some technique used repetitions. And one thing that is very important, and it's the most important thing in this method, it's to balance your expectations. And why? Many people think when they are going to remind some piece, they have to play from the beginning to the end. And if you have this expectation, you're gonna be frustrated and you're gonna be quickly frustrated. It's very common to see people, ah, oh, no, no, I, I really don't remember. And I say, I, I, I believe strongly that if you have already played with fluency, some piece and you are months without playing it there is some technique you can recover all the ability without using uh some score or reading again the piece but one thing is very important when you start this process of recovering taking from the beginning of the piece and going forward when you forget some note uh, you you go to the beginning again and try try to play again and what do you have to expect not all the continue part of the piece you have to expect to know the next note you go step by step and sometimes you're gonna be surprised because the brain works memorizing chunks of information and when you sometimes remember one note you're gonna remind uh, a whole a whole part of the piece but the expectations are very important because if you don't look where uh, you were before and where you are now in this repetition sometimes you're gonna think you didn't uh, evolve sufficiently so pay attention in what was the last part of the piece that you or less the last note of the piece that you could play and what you are being capable of doing now. One note can be very, you, we can, we can uh, be very happy to remember one note because it's the sign that the memory is, the, is doing a good job in this recovery process. All right, to know more, there is one, there, there is a series of lives that I do, five, uh, six lives talking about this process of recovering. It's, it will be very important for you that is learning Brazilian music because I recommend strongly that you have um, more, you create one repertory. Uh, you have so many Brazilian, you, you take many Brazilian songs by heart, to play by heart. This will give you language, this will gonna give you uh, um, intense notion of the, our accent and how we do melodies here. All right, I hope you have enjoyed this tip and thanks for watching. I'm Luciano Ruas and every day doing quick tips and lives about this process. If you, wanna, if you want to know more deep this process of learning Brazilian music, write for, uh, watch for my lives, all right? Thanks for watching and see you tomorrow for more quick tips and lives. Thank you. Obrigado. Tchau, tchau.